Challenge assessment one, retake one. Here in this challenge assessment, I'm gonna teach you how to measure current, which is Kirchhoff's current law, and it can be known as the node law. I'm gonna teach you how to measure voltage in a circuit, which can be known as Kirchhoff's voltage law or the loop law. I'm also gonna tell you what Ohm's law is and where it applies to. Ohm's law is the states that the current is proportional to the voltage and the inverse to the resistance. Which, we can be, which can be seen with V equals IR, which is Ohm's law. Ohm's law only applies to resistors. As seen in this simple circuit, Ohm's law is only going to apply to this resistor that is in series with everything. It will not apply to this voltage source when I plug it in. Moving on, I will teach you how to measure voltage. Here on your multimeter, let's change what we want to voltage. Voltage is the difference between two points. It can also be um, used to find many things. All right, so since voltage is the difference between two points, I'm gonna take my two leads I'm and I am going to place it across my resistor. And we're gonna see what value I get while looking at my multimeter at the same time. Looks like I'm getting minus 8.13, that just means I had my leads flipped. So if we flip our leads, I'm gonna get a positive value now. This is important because it gives us a negative and a positive. It's also important to note that we do not have to break the circuit. It's only the difference between two points. So moving on, let's learn how we can measure current. Um, for current, it's important that we do break the circuit because we will blow a fuse if we don't break the circuit. As you can see here, I took out one of my wires and I'm going to measure across my resistor and this wire with the circuit broken. I'm going to complete the circuit with my multimeter. Now, as you can see here, I'm going to change it to amps. I'm going to take my two leads and then complete the circuit. And when we measure, we get a nice value. Moving on. Um, so as you could see here, this is a circuit. So the current is the same, the voltage is the same because everything is in series. And this can be proved with Kirchhoff's current law and Kirchhoff's voltage law, which is the loop law and the node law. So in the end, you should know how to measure current voltage and you should know what ohm's law is and where it applies it only applies to resistors this is important thank you